Hi guys, the Edgar Leshi 2 is an awesome rifle to shoot, which is a lot of fun as well. It can chew through a tin of pellets in a heartbeat like it's nobody else's business. The only thing that holds me back from having more fun and plinking with the Edgar Leshi is filling up these 8 shot rotary magazines. Of course, you can remove the lid manually, fill, fill the 8 shots one by one, it's only 8 shots, put it back in, but that is time spent that I'd rather spend having fun and plinking with my Leshi. So it was only a few weeks after the Edgun Leshy came out, people starting to have the same issue like I had, wanted to spend more time having fun with their Leshy instead of filling up those magazines. So people started creating speed loaders for the Edgun Leshy. Hell, even I made one myself with a 3D printer, which has served me well up until now. But Edgun, of course, realized this, and so they wanted to make a proper speed loader for the Edgun Leshy as well. And so now they just have released the speed loader by Edgun. So, let's dive into the tabletop view and I'll tell you everything you need to know about it. And here we have it guys, the speed loader by Adgun. Comes in this really nice packaging, same thing like we have seen on the PZ and the EZ. The speed loader is available in 4.5, 5.5, 6.35 and 7.62, so uh, 177, 22, 25 and 30 caliber. And for the rest, except the nice branding, not a lot to see on the outside. So let's open it up. And the only thing you get in the box is the speed loader itself, because it doesn't need any other accessories. Just like this. And let's put the box to the side. And here we have it, the speed loader. Made from this nice black anodized uh, aluminum. And you can see there are six switches that you can put just like this. But actually, you only have five stages to fill and that's the first five. And let me just explain you why. The easy process of filling happens just like this. Close the bottom one. As you can see maybe on camera, there is a small divider that moves into place when you're uh, putting that toggle. Just put them in one by one. I'll quickly make sure I don't double feed them. Like this. Close the second one. And now your pellets are locked in. And you can go ahead and fill up the rest of the magazine. And just like that, all the stages are filled. Actually, only these five stages are filled as the top one is left to be open without any pellets or slugs. The magnets you see there on top are for a good reason, because your uh, magazine has this metal cover on top. Just put it on top of it, pull it away, and the metal cover stays there. Once you filled your magazine, put it back on, slide it off, and your cover is back in the right position. So, the way how this magazine operates, very easy. Put your uh, metal plate off with the magnets, put your magazine on the bottom, open it off, quick shake, go back to the top, slide it off and just like this, this in a matter of seconds, you have filled your magazine. Really cool, very practical. And you can do this for all the various stages. So let's say you want to go to the second stage. I quickly removed uh, the pellets from this one. Again, on top of it, open it up. Stick it into the bottom, second slider, just like this. They come out, the ones that stick out, just push them a little bit inside, go back to the top and just like this, you have refilled another magazine. Imagine doing this by hand, it will take you a lot more than a few seconds. Now, for those who don't really want to take their magazine out of the leshy, it's the same process. Take that metal cover off, I'll try to do this on camera. This sticks in like this. Open it up, give it a small wiggle, go back with your cover, slide it off, close your leshy and you're good for another plinking session. Let me take that little screw for a second. This comes from my Eagle Vision scope mount, just like this, make sure I don't lose it. So, pretty cool way to fill up or a magazine when you just have it in your hand or even when it's mounted to your Edgun leshy, all very practical having these extra shots in your pocket. As I mentioned before, 40 shots or slugs, but I think I found 
a little clever trick if you really need to have another extra eight shots in your pocket. If you have one spare one just like this, you can add another eight pellets at the top if you want, just like this. Oops, just like this. Take that extra ring, put it on top, twist it so those extra pellets can't come out and this gives you another 8 shots if you really need them. But that's not really how the way Edgun has meant it. That's just me thinking while I'm making this video. So let's get back to the normal table. And there you have it guys, the speed loader by Edgun. Really nice quality product, very robust that holds about 40 pellets or slugs and with that extra metal plate on top you can maybe sneak in another 8. Really cool product, very robust, so you can always put it in your pocket or in your backpack while you're on your various outings and have those extra shots with you for a quick refill of that magazine. Really cool. I hope you enjoyed the unboxing of that speed loader by Adgun. If you have any questions, please leave them in the comment section down below and I will answer them as soon as I can. As always, I thank you for watching. Please subscribe to my channel, like this video so I can keep bringing more of these videos and I hope to see you back in the next one. Bye.